Reading Bhagavad Gita. Moral Story. Once on a mountain farm lived an old man with his grandson. Old man used to wake up early in morning every day and sat on table to read Bhagavad Gita. His grandson used to admire his grandfather and wanted to be just like him, so he tried to do everything the way his grandfather does. One day grandson went to his grandfather and said, Dadu, I read Bhagavad Gita daily just like you but I am not able to understand most of it. And whatever I am able to understand I forget it as soon as I close the book. If I forget what I read or what good is it doing me to read Bhagavad Gita? Grandfather was holding a coal basket. He turned to boy and handed him coal basket saying, Go down to river and bring me a basket of water. Boy did as told but as soon as he could get to home all the water from the basket would get leaked. Grandfather smiled and said, Go back and try again but this time try to move a little faster. Boy agreed and this time he ran faster to reach home with water but even this time the basket was empty as he got home. Grandfather asked him to try again but every time basket get empty in the way. Grandson was tired and said, it's impossible to carry water in a basket. I can bring you a bucket full of water. Grandfather replied, I don't want bucket of water, I want you to bring water in coal basket only, try harder. Boy knew that it would be impossible but still he tried again and this time he ran as fast as possible but again basket was empty, boy was tired. He said to his grandfather, see daddy it's useless. Grandfather replied, you think it's useless but look at the basket. Boy looked at the basket and saw that basket was looking much cleaner. He saw that all the coal stains were removed from the basket and now it was clean from inside and out. Grandfather said, you see that this basket is now clean from all stains. That's what happens when you read Bhagavad Gita. You may not understand or remember what you read but it words will change you from inside and out. Quote, 